Let's take you into the business of governance in Lagos State from the governor's office. The Lagos State Governor, Papajide Sonwolu, played host to former and serving speakers and deputy speakers of Houses of Assembly across the country for an interactive session in Lagos. The occasion was a strategic session to most importantly appreciate and consider the political expertise and experience of the 2023 presidential hopeful Ashiwaju Bola Ahmed Tunubu on the platform of the APC. For Mr. Governor, he outlined the various historic political contributions of Bola Metunubu, who happens to have performed excellently well as a former senator of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. It's important for me to forget this because that is how Ashwaju laid the foundation of the Lagos we all can celebrate here today. And I think it's also important for me to take the comments of the former Speaker of the Anambra House of Assembly, who also came up and talked about what we need to do to realize the female fold in our midst, to ensure that the biases that is around us, Ashwaju is one of the few people that have continued to push that. And if might have forgotten, Ashwaju was the first person that has a deputy governor, has a woman. Ashwaju is a former senator that has the requisite <laughs> legislative experience. Not only does he have ex legislative experience, of course, he has taken executive experience to a level that has never been seen before. And by further extension, he has created the most vibrant judicial experience that is second to none in this country. Because indeed, it was during his tenure that we had the judiciary reform that we have in Lagos that has been the template that has been used in other parts of this country. On his part, Senator Bolak Metunumbu emphatically argued why he is the right man for the job as the president of Nigeria. And I am only right to stand before you wishing and requesting for your support to be called in 2023 elected president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Yes, I'm well educated. Yes. Sand. One of the best alumni left the school with honors. I was a tutor as a student of my fellow classmates. And I was one of the most sorted after graduates of that period, recruited by the best accounting and financing in the world. And to achieve honors, sumla kumla is not easy. While you stay after work, I did put all together because I was focused, I was effective, I was organized and able to juggle my timetable and build my line on a straight lane of athleticism that Nigeria is right now. As I name Nigeria, Nigeria needs me. And that's the picture talking about the business of governance in Lagos from the governor's office. The City of Lagos TV show will continue in a moment. <laughs> 